What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm pretty pumped, just showed up in the mail amidst all the quarantine. Um, hopefully you're safe and healthy in our social distancing. We have been shut down as of today, actually. Um, so anyway, this is from the Kickstarter, or maybe it was Indiegogo, I use both and can't recall, but where Peter McKinnon and Nomadic teamed up to make a travel backpack, camera cube pack, and all sorts of other camera accessories, memory card case, filter case, accessory case. So, my Kickstarter came in. Now, I didn't get the travel bag. Just wasn't about to drop the money on it, and I kind of like Peak Designs better. So, anyway, today I started opening these up, and I realized, what the hell am I doing? I need to do this on camera. They shipped them in two boxes. Why? I don't know. Um, probably cost more in shipping, but we're not necessarily going to focus on this one today. We're going to save it for another video, but this is the accessory case. This one, though. So we got our little fly the flag skull and crossbones over here on the side. We got the Peter McKinnon nomadic symbol. The most functional gear ever, it says. Nomadic. And this is the cube pack. So it is a camera cube that opens up and transforms into a day pack. Pretty sweet. And an awesome, awesome idea. So I figured I really couldn't talk about Peter McKinnon product without having some coffee. Of course, it is not Peter McKinnon's coffee. So here we go. This thing is pretty nice size. Um, as it is with just the camera cube, it is a 7 liter cube. Around the side. Okay, 7 to 21 liter. I was going to get to the 21. I wish we got all the details here. And of course, it fits perfectly in the actual camera travel bag, which we did not buy. As you see, we've got a zipper on top over here. And this larger zipper pull is very nice. It's got the Peter McKinnon Nomadic logo on it, which I dig. It's the one we're going to open up. Here's our cube. We do have removable dividers. Three X's on the larger one. Smaller one. We've got the Pete's Pirate Life logo here. So you get one large and two small in this. And yes, you can configure it however you want with the gear size, your camera, whatever. I use a mirrorless camera and it's over here recording, so I can't necessarily put it in here to show you. But what I like about this is it's small. It will fit my lenses a lot better, which are definitely a lot smaller than your typical DSLR. this top one and it is just your typical little tiny zipper pull not cool like the other one um, which is kind of a bummer I don't know why they would do one very nice zipper pull on one zipper and not on the other so don't know as we open this one up We have our day pack. Zipper pulls on this are the same as the one to open this compartment bag. 21 liters on the back here. Just got your little hardware. Clip it. Slide right in. And 
and also we have adjustable sternum strap and it is removable with the clips on the side. So the material actually feels pretty durable, especially for a collapsible day bag. Typically when you see these types of bags, they're made of a mesh or um, like a windbreaker kind of material. Still crinkly like this, but nowhere near as nice feeling or durable. This is also water resistant. And as the zipper right down here has the water guard on it, up top, it does not, it's got a zipper guard, but it's not the aqua guard all over. But in most cases, if you get caught in rain, the most expensive, most important thing is your camera, and it's going to be down here. I also didn't mention that this is pretty padded down there as well. So, good job on that one. So on the base of it, when it opens up, you get your nice logo here. Um, it is silver on that material, so it probably will scratch off. Let's not kid ourselves. Um, so hopefully it lasts a good while. Now, nowhere on Nomadics or the Kickstarter does it actually tell you what material this is. But I will say um, I'm pleasantly surprised that it is not that typical windbreakery kind of plasticky material. This little tiny loop here, which I'm not too pumped about. I do like carrying my bags, and this does not feel as substantial as I wish it would be. Again, sternum strap, removable. So the top of the compartment ends up being on your lower back here, which is nice. Um, it's got a little bit of a moisture wicking kind of feel to it. Definitely some airflow. And again, down here, now you probably couldn't see it in the original, but you just push on it and it pops right off. What else is nice is that through here is completely open. If you have your own type of strap, you can use it as a sling or even a fanny if you're cool enough to do that. I am not cool enough to pull a fanny pack off. The straps themselves are very, very lightweight, made of a thicker mesh. So it's got a little bit of padding on it, probably not going to be the most comfortable thing if you're wearing this all day long. Um, but still pretty cool. And we'll go ahead and skip it up the main compartment, which is pretty much a dump. And you do have a little bit of stability right here on the bottom. And right on your back, you do have a nice little mesh, almost see-through compartment. Put your phone, um, anything that doesn't need to just be dumped in the main storage. And then to pack it back up, make sure you detach your straps. Sure that will get easier the more you do it but I do wish that there was something to keep it completely flat on top um, I know this is going to be nice feeling on your back but I'd like it to not be lumpy up there just me being picky I suppose now as the world is I can't necessarily go out and test this at the moment load it up, go take photos, anything like that. So another video will be coming in hopefully the short future. This thing is retailing right now for $124.99. We'll call it $125. You can get it on Nomadic's website under the camera tab, which is where all of Pete's gear is. I believe you can also still order on their Indiegogo or Kickstarter. I'm not sure which it is. I apologize. I will put a link um, to at least the Nomadic website below, so you can check out this and all of his other gear. I don't think this is on Amazon. If it is, I will link it there as well. But it does have Nomadic's lifetime warranty, and I'm pretty sure in here, it tells me right in here where to go to register so I can get my lifetime warranty. 
which I will be doing as soon as I stop recording this. Um, yeah, so if you got any value out of this, dug it, hit that like button, share, subscribe. I totally appreciate it. If you didn't like it, go ahead and hit the dislike button. It's cool too. But until next time, I'll see you in the next video, which I'm going to record in the next few minutes, which will be on that. And I'm pumped. So thanks for watching.